From 1997 to 2005, CIRS was the place that I called home. With every new day was a new adventure, and with every new adventure, there were endless opportunities to live, love, laugh, celebrate with family. With the intent of capturing these memories, here's a presentation of our school times. My journey in CRS was for eight long years, passed off in 2005. Uh, my life in CRS was uh, a blend with uh, education, uh, spirituality, extracurricular activities and sports. And uh, I have learned three important values which I am using in my day-to-day -day life. Those are uh, discipline, uh, balance in life between work and uh, home, family. And uh, the third one was a good leadership qualities. Uh, Chinmay had, had given me the opportunity to become a sports secretary and that has helped me in becoming a good leader and a better leader and uh, helped me take good decisions. The most amazing years of our childhood that can never be erased. The Maggie, the tuck shop, the horse riding back in our days. Never ending banter with our friends that still go on. Uh, it's, it's been fun and even despite we're 30, we still reminisce those days. Friendships that have been bonded forever, uh, integral part of our childhood and one of the best years. That's what CIRS means to us, means to me. Hari Om, it is a pleasure to know that CIRS celebrates 25 years this year. CIRS has not only transformed one student but many many other students across the globe. It takes me back to those two years, which changed my life completely. It changed my personality. It gave me understanding to the values of life. It gave me friends, family and spiritual values, which are very necessary in this present era. Hariyam and happy 25th anniversary Chinmaya. You know, there's not a day that goes by that I don't think about my experience at CIRS. It was definitely one of the most positive and transformative experiences of my life. And I'm so grateful that I had the opportunity to teach there and to learn from all of you guys. Um, you might have learned a little bit from me, but I think I learned so much more from all of you. Um, and also, over these last 25 years, to be able to follow your lives via Facebook or email and to see um, your educational pursuits and all the passions and, and talents that you're going after and your families, and it's just been so wonderful to follow your lives. It's truly the gift that keeps on giving, and I'm so grateful for that. So thank you for allowing me to still be part of your lives. It's a gift that keeps on giving. And I also wanted to give a shout out to um, Raj Prasad, who was one of the, the forming board members, who was the one who originally brought me over. Um, he's long since passed away, but you know, a lot of love went into the making of Chinmaya. And I know that, um, you know, including my mom and my stepdad, Harriet and Joe Shakes, who have also now passed away. Um, but I know that they would be so proud of me and of all of you and, of everything that Chinmaya is today. Um, we're a family. Whether we see each other in 25 years, it doesn't matter. Such a special place and you guys will always be in my heart and I hope you stay in touch with me. I hope you and your families are doing well throughout this crazy time and um, I hope our next 25th anniversary we actually get to see each other in person. That would be wonderful. So stay in touch, stay healthy and Hari Om. Hello CIRS, hello from Canada. Et pour mes étudiants français, bonjour du Canada. Um, happy 25th anniversary to CIRS. I feel very fortunate to have taught there uh, now almost 20 years ago. Hard to believe that it was so long ago. Uh, I have very, very happy memories of being at CIRS from the amazing colleagues and friends I made there to the 
remarkable students, many of whom I'm still in touch with through the magic of Facebook. Uh, I wish CIRS many continued years of success and evolution. Rion. I learned a lot of life, life lessons at school and um, developed some good habits such as praying before my meals and before bedtime. I still hold on very dearly to my Sierra's book of hymns and read out all the sotras and shlokas that I learned uh, while I was at school. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank all my former teachers and all my batchmates for making my journey so special. Thank you. I truly have some wonderful memories from my time at Jinmaya. Coming from a very close-knit family and going into a dorm kind of environment was very different from me, but I thoroughly enjoyed my time there. Whether it was hiding in the cupboard to avoid jogging at every cost in the morning, or whether it was making Maggie with my friends in the middle of the night with geezer water, or whether it was negotiating with the Anna for that one extra gulab jamun, or whether it was getting ready together for that perfect Sunday look that we were all obsessed with. CIRS gave us the opportunity to experience a lot of unusual activities, right from carpentry to pottery to playing all kinds of different games just to experience what it felt like to play that game or whether it was celebrating different festivals with a lot of meaning and fun, opening our minds to diverse things on a daily basis. I hold these memories so close to my heart and I'm thankful to have experienced all of them. Yes. I'm very thankful for my time at CIRS because it gave me the self-confidence and leadership skills I carry with me today. I came to CIRS with the cliché dream of becoming an engineer or a doctor. Today I am a state award winning television host and an actor and the reason is CIRS. CIRS gave me confidence to pursue my dream and I owe a lot uh, to CIRS.